Lesson 2 The second tutorial is all about the game interface concept and how its elements connect with one another. You'll find out how to implement various classes and create game resources to be used later in the game development. Now, let's create the game. The first thing we look at is the tasks, and the second thing we look at is the gameplay. Our task is to create a scroller game. A spaceship is flying through the corridor and is collecting bonuses. The player's goal is to collect a certain number of bonuses, all while not colliding with the walls of the corridor. Then we look at the application interface. It will include a main menu, pause menu, menu lose, menu win, and game. Now we can see the connection between our elements of the interface, so let's look at each interface individually. Main menu. We will place the buttons in main menu, such as the start button, game title, and background. Pause menu. The pause menu will consist of a background that has two buttons, continue button and a main menu button. The win and lose menu. These menus will consist of a background, header text, and the main menu button. Game. On the game screen will be placed playing field, pause button, and score panel. In order to implement the gameplay, we should bring ship class, bonus class, barrier class, and background class into play. Then, let's take a look at resources, which we will use in our application. These resources are main menu, background, title, and start button. Next, in the pause, win, and lose menu will also be some used resources, such as buttons and background. In the game screen, we will be using ship, bonus, barrier, background, and pause button resources. In the next lesson, we will prepare the application resources and create our project. I look forward to seeing you there.